hero in there. He realized that it pulled him a little different. Check out those bracers. And they're just the basic. Found a nice pair of those on one of my playthroughs. It was an of the glade suffix. Gorgons on this run. I got the ultimate spawn cycle. That stinks. So if that happens to you, you have to log out to desktop and keep doing it until it changes. If you just log out to your menu, it won't change. through it this way and finish it up and uh, then I'll if I decide to run it again I'll log out until I get what I need So this is the one you'd want to stay at if you're going to do any farming down here. about wrapped up. going to do this whole area here. I'm just going to clear away to the Telkeen Minotaur Lord.
Sometimes there's a majestic in that corner there, but not this time. do with him is I try to take out these traps before he notices me. At least the two bottom ones. Oops. And though he was right there. I don't need to take any extra damage out of the yeah, here he comes. There's supposed to be, you know, some slow effect on these ice shards, but it really doesn't do nothing to him. Take a quick look at his stuff. I don't think it's anything special, but check it out. Well, attack speed and minus re minus requirements. Vendor. And this chest almost never has anything in it. It's like one of the worst majestics, one of the worst boss chests in the game right here. It's terrible. I never expect to get anything out of it. I usually have a harder time than him than I do the Telkeen. So let's head on down there and do that. Telkin's Veil, it looks like. No, it's the uh, seal. It's a monster rare. That's a robust um, affix. 
Strength, health. This one has some energy regen too. So I'm getting an awful lot of wrists. And nothing special here. Looks like I got some stuff for the vendor. Let's see if we got anything in this. One green helm. Got a lot of stats on it. Minus two health regeneration per second. No thanks. Got the three percent experience is nice, but nah, I'm not giving up the health. You, you destroyed him. I saw it all from where I was hiding. It was amazing. I, I, I still can't believe that a mortal actually managed to pass the Telkin. Unfortunately, there was no way to stop him from destroying the conduit. Now, we are cut off from the gods. They cannot hear our cries and, and they cannot help us when we need them most. If there is no way to reconnect the two realms, I fear that humankind stands little chance against the monster Scourge. Please, go to Egypt. Seek out a man named Imhotep, a sage of the Order of Prometheus. He knows more about the nature of the conduit than any other mortal. He may be our only hope. You will find him in the city of Rakotis. Take my ship. It is anchored at the river nearby. All right, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to I'm going to give this another run, but I'm going to have to log out and try to get the spawns to change. And once I get that settled, I'll come back in and we'll uh, make another run at it. I had to log out to desktop six times to get these Gorgons to start spawning. Might not have really been worth it, because I'm only going to make this run one time. But we'll give it a go and see if we can find anything. There's a couple of the orange guys in here, that's what you want to see. Orange, green, and heroes. Even some of that sentinel armor is pretty good that you can get off the guard. Great, but it's pretty decent if you don't have anything going yet early in the game. Oh well, so much for that run. Let's go do the Telkin again. Then we'll get out of here. We'll head over to Egypt. If there's anything in that corner spot. No, there's a hero minotaur in there. I think, yeah, I got his attention. Of 
course now I used my uh, quick recovery. I wanted that big up to fight, so give it a little time to cool down. Kill a few things out here. pretty good. Alright, we're ready to go back in. Get all healed up. Let's see if I can do this better this time and take out some of those traps. I have to see where the heck he is. Ooh. out of the way. Now if he can walks over to the other side. If he's anywhere near that trap, he's, it's going to attract him. Alright, he's, he's across the room. Alright, now we're ready. Yeah, I might even be able to get more of these. stuff. Check the chest. I should have broke this. Brimstone. Can't believe I actually got something out of this. That is a ring with some fire and burn damage, I believe. Burn damage. Fire damage, burn. Got some energy. I'm going to put it on. I mean, it's not going to help my ice shards at all. It'll help my melee attack, I'm sure. Maybe it won't. Oops. Put it in the wrong spot, no wonder. It does help. Put together a few of these things. to the Telkeen. Uh, I got a couple more chests. Telkeen and then Egypt.
Let's see if we can get anything. Shiver blood. And a green breastplate. Got my other uh, storage bag too. So I don't have enough, enough dexterity for this at the moment. Probably can get it in if I just rearrange a few things. This isn't too bad I, for for a little breastplate. All right, I have to hit up the vendor with some of this other stuff. Let's get out of here. Head over and unlock Egypt. Leave it there, I think. Talk to him after. I'm going to go open up the portal and. Um, Make sure I do the rebirth fountain. Talk to him on the way back through here also. Yeah, let's end this here and when we come back we'll start act two. See you in the next video.